some people, how are you doing? My name is Leah. I'm a Jewish Orthodox mom living in Israel. Today we're going to do Shabbat prep. We're going to cook for Shabbat. It's around Pesach time, Passover, so everything's going to be good for Passover. Also, my mom's in town, so we're going to go to a local organic goat farm and check everything out and walk around and try some of their fruit yogurt smoothies. It's springtime over here, so we're going to talk about the spiritual side of spring. So stick around while we walk around Israel and cook and let's learn and grow together. <laughs> לעולם ועד, השם מלך, השם מלך, השם ימלוך, לעולם ועד, השם מלך, השם מלך, השם ימלוך, לעולם ועד, השם מלך, השם מלך, השם ימלוך, לעולם ועד. Okay, this is like my new favorite dish. It's so good with the chicken and it cooks in a crock pot for a long time. And it's like sweet and sour. And you guys have to try it. I want to cook it every single Shabbat. <laughs> Hashem is king, Hashem was king, Hashem will forever and ever be king. Hashem is king, Hashem was king, Hashem will forever and ever be king. Hashem melech, Hashem malach. What were you first in Israel? Relatives' wedding. I thought I had him one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was my we waited a year after we got married, and it took a honeymoon a year later to Israel. Wow. Yeah. You were 26 years old? 26. Wow, wow, wow. That's amazing. <laughs> Well, my mom's first time in Israel was on their honeymoon. My dad went a lot of times before. But it's amazing, like they planted a seed in the land of Israel that their daughter would live here and settle here. I mean, never in a million years when I was little, I thought I would do this, but here I am. And just like humans, we are souls and we're bodies. Israel is like our body and the people living in Israel is the soul. Everything we see, trees and plants, this is like, you know, the body. But the deeper thing, actually what Kabbalah says is the roots. Just like people, we have bodies, we also have souls. The souls are the roots. Sometimes we don't even see it. We look at the people from their problems and oh my gosh, look how annoying they are. Do this, they do that. But that's not who they are. They're actually the deepest things in the world. We gotta nurture those roots and water them and, and be kind to everybody and, be, and say nice words to people. So I think when we're spring cleaning when we're cleaning we really have to clean out the negative thoughts we have for people and the negative energies we put out and just think about the real deep parts of people and focus on sending them positivity words of encouragement and bless them and just see the world bloom more through positivity It's also my favorite to have vegetables that are like kind of pickly and just eat something healthy during the Shabbat meal I love it I make it all the time and put it in jars and have it ready to eat on Shabbat Say hey, I'll be gone today. I'll be back around the way. Seems like everywhere I go, the more I see, the less I know. But I know one thing that I love you. Yeah, I love you. I love you. I love you. Yeah. I said I've been a lot of places all around the way. I've seen a lot of joy and I've seen you pain But I don't want to write a love song for the world I just want to write a song about a book What are they? Seriously, Danny Lyons? I say, hey, I've been gone again But I'll be back, come around the way Seems like everywhere I go The more I see, the less I know I know one thing that I love you Baby girl, I love you, I love you I love you My mama told me don't lose you Because the best luck I had was you and Singing hey I'll be gone again I'll be back uh, okay. around the way these are the flowers of Israel. They bloom everywhere. You're not allowed to pick them. But I drew them, and it's a fun little poster you can print up and frame. Also, I put it on a card. You can check out my Etsy store for art and different blessings for Passover and all different holidays I have at my store. Ha, ha, ha.
I didn't always eat kosher, and I had a favorite soup growing up that was not kosher, but now I make it kosher. The fish chowder, it's so good. It's very fishy and creamy, a lot of vegetables. Everyone loves it. It's one of my favorite things to eat for soup on Shabbat. Hello, we're at an organic goat farm in Israel. They sell chicken eggs all over Israel. I remember eating them, the organic eggs in Tel Aviv and Jerusalem are everywhere. I think this is one of the most beautiful places in Israel. I was here like 13, 14 years ago on a trip and I can't believe I live here now. That's Rabbi, yeah. And this is Rabbi. You want this? Mm-hmm. Baruch Atah Adonai. Elohim Mochab Shakoni, but bro. Oh, man. So good. Right? Fresh and yummy and berries and strawberries. Goat milk each. It doesn't taste like goat milk. Like It just tastes really good. Good. Okay. It's okay. You did it. Wow. Good, good job. job. Shako. Amen. Amen. Good job. Hey. I'm on the rock. Hey. Okay. Hi. See the one that be a star. Good job. See the thought in the trouble. I said I'm on. Hi, my name is Elam and spring has sprung! I wanted to tell you something about spring. The word for spring in Hebrew is Aviv. And Aviv sounds like small Av. Av is the month of Tisha B'Av, which is actually a very sad month. But it's also the month where redemption, the full redemption will take place. And Aviv is the beginning of redemption the exodus from Egypt and we are really seeing the whole world wake up again and uh, all the plants coming out and it is rejuvenating to the soul to be in the month of spring. I just want to give us all a blessing that this spring we will spring like flowers and really reach true freedom and closeness to Hashem. Everybody happy Pesach! It was so much fun. Thanks for hanging out with me. I hope you had a nice time. Let me know your name and where you're from below and how you're doing. What's your favorite part about spring? And may God bless us this spring that even in the winter if we felt oh, I'm depressed and all shriveled and all anything like this, may God bloom us and make us happy again and may we get the sunshine and really tap into growing and being the best person we want to be. I appreciate each and every one of you watching and, and commenting. If you want to learn more and grow together, subscribe. I'd love to see you again. You can watch these videos between now and the next time I see you.